Hi friends, human resource management and payroll management is most important part in any organization and there is a need of a very suitable and perfect application software everywhere in each organization be it big, small or very large. At DGCN, this channel we are exploring on the ideas and solutions through which we can start our own digital business. In this video, we are going to explore a solution through which you can provide a human resource management solution along with the payroll management solution to organizations, companies or enterprises, whatever. So this is going to be a very good idea to start with this solution and the solution is going to be very, very effective and it is available just for $29. So uh, you have to spend $29 for this solution ready to install the script and it is going to be yours in white label mode. The SaaS model is available. So you can simply install this solution for your client. You can white label it and further sell it for multiple organization and all. So $39 plus a basic hosting and a domain name. This is the basic requirement and you can simply start this solution, human resources management solution. And this is the super admin screen. I'm going to show you three screens, super admin, company login and even employee login so that you may get an idea how the system works and how you can onboard on the system. It is very easy to use solution. So it is going to be very fruitful for the organization having low capacity of a staff and having low efficiency on computers. So it is easy to use, easy to install and it can be started within hours so you don't need to have any specific technical knowledge because we are going to help you in every step in installing this application and getting it live you can do at your own so solution come with a very easy to use documentation as well so you can explore the solution through the video description link i'm going to add all the relevant links in the video description so let us start with this super admin panel and first of all this is the dashboard which is showing the basic idea what is going inside the system. But we have to start as a super admin, you have to make a basic setup. Like this is a completely white level solution. You are going to change the logo, light, logo and the fab icon and all basic things. You can change the color, email settings and the SMS setting, payment gateway setting. So if it is being used in India, you can simply use the uh, Indian currency and reserve pay payment gateway is here popularly being used in India. However, there are multiple payment gateways like direct bank transfer is also available just in case if you want to use and multiple payment gateways that is relevant to the multiple countries as well. So you have to configure these all things so using API, simple API can be configured and like uh, I will show you the razor pay screen that can be helpful in context of India. If it is, this is razor pay and we just need to put the public key and the secret key and the payment gateway will be integrated. Similarly, you have to put all the uh, details like mail, billing system, you can change the color and all basic things. So email setting, the screen gives us the email setting, similarly payment setting and the pusher setting. So push app and app ID, we can use the recap jam, the storage settings like it can be at our server or so uh, maximum upload size can be decided, the formats that can be uploaded. SEO settings, the cache settings, cookie consent and the chat GPT. Yes, chat GPT also can be integrated here. This is very simple to onboard and you have to put all these details. At very first time, this is single time activity and you are going to make it live. The solution is going to make, make live. Okay, so this solution also gives a landing page solutions. I mean, a live website can be uh, created using this solution. So this is the top bar information and the home page information you can certainly change and uh, this is the home page where we can offer the users to log in like a landing page website so basic functionalities and basic information for a landing page website can be controlled here by putting all these details like testimonials FAQ, pricing plan and guys since it is a SaaS person so a pricing plan can be good option for displaying the plans you are offering to your prospective clients. Next, I'm coming back to the dashboard again and I'll show you the companies where you can configure the company. Since it is a multi-login model and you can add 
as many company as you need and there are company plans like uh, different plans can be free plan war plan so you can edit the plan deliverables and you can set the company's login and uh, all like like if it is this is the company we are going to set the users here so we can set and enable disable users here so there are many users can be set for a particular company and you can simply create a new company by clicking on this plus icon so create new companies here and the company mail id and the login is enabled or disabled so you can create users add a new company option is here so you can create as many company as required you can create plans as i said this can be a plan for different companies you can offer the solution in free mode for a limited users and you can decide what actually you want to offer like you can edit the plan deliverables and you can change the pricing the uh, users numbers and the trial enable or whatever uh, what you want to uh, set here for different plan stages the companies who are logged in can request for plan changes so you can approve the plan changes depending upon the receipt of payment or the conditions you are applying a referral program is also here so company can offer a referral program similarly coupon for promotion orders or processing the orders like um, what orders you have received for onboarding the company and all so this is very simple and next is the email template so this is the email template so there can be multiple email templates so like this is the complete email template that you can use in the system and you can of course uh, change the email templates and the details of email template like payroll is here so you can uh, change the payroll email communication and all so as i said it is very simple and as an admin you are going to set all this thing next i am going to show you the company login so that you may understand what companies are doing at this system and before we proceed i must show you the landing page that is this is the landing page that you can offer and this is the login screen and at the login screen you can offer different logins credentials and all so this is the login screen i mean the landing page screen where the companies and the users are going to land and they can read the features login and access the system and even register option is also here so the users can new users can register here so it is not required to create every user each user at your end users can register and you can definitely control them from the admin backend so let us go to the company login now now i am here as company login and the dashboard is showing the basic idea what is going inside the system like meeting schedules the calendars and all so there is nothing like onboarding however there is system setup for company as well uh, like this is the super admin for company so super admin is going to change all the basic things for the particular company for which this is being the system is being used so all details are almost same like additional things are also here like zoom meetings the slack settings the telegram the twilo the twilo is the sms gateway similarly slack is the chat gateway or zoom meetings for meetings and additional things are here no objection certificate settings certificate for experience so there are basic settings that is applicable for particular company so this is uh, some showing some additional setting like in the business setting you have to upload the logo system setting so the currency can be set the ip restoration and the zoom meeting and all these settings are applicable for companies next is the system subscription plans so the company can request a plan upgrade or of course the free plan is here so company can subscribe for a new plan depending upon the uses of system so company can upgrade the plan degrade the plan even so it depends on the company owner company users again a referral program is here so company can refer to other users so that they may gain some money and of course you are going to get money at every step you are going to earn at every step this is completely a saas model so you are earning at every step so don't worry it is a complete digital business solution okay so the order is again here so if company is getting some orders so this is and the order like uh, referral plans and all okay 
So the HRM setup is the screen where the company can manage the branches like uh, different branch options are here and the department designation leave type and all basic details. So there might be different branches of a company, similarly different departments, designation, leave type, document type. So this is complete setting for a particular setting. Uh, what can be in the com company? There might be department, designation, leave type, document type, pay, pay slip type, allowance options, loan options, reduction options, word type, and the training type, award type, and termination type. So there might be different labels and different settings for particular company. So all can be set on this screen for this particular company. And that I am showing and similarly there might be several companies. So this is a company login screen. What company is doing? I am showing you. Okay, so this is company HRM setup, HRM module setup. Next, I can show you the notification template that is going to be pushed for notification and it can be generated with AI as well. However, it is very simple to create. So this is notification. Similarly, messenger settings are here. So what messengers? Uh, internal message system is there so users can communicate in uh, their self so this is user and the groups and uh, messenger settings so you can enable the messenger and it can be used for for the users internal communication a lot company policy is the next screen where you can set the new company policy and edit the policy as well so this is the policy and the document can be attached here so it is applicable to company and the users can access such documents. These are the documents which can be used inside the company for different purposes like all users, the document and the new documents can be created, I mean the uploaded from here on this screen. Okay, so the assets. What are the assets? So it can be added. So new assets can be created what is the employee name and the name and the purchase date the support until and all so these are the asset management basically zoom meeting in case the company configures the zoom and the meetings again so event created meeting or the team needed further it can be edited or new meeting type can be added here uh, similarly events and the tickets are also here so this is basically for uh, old ticket, support tickets and all. So this is the ticket and new ticket can be created for any support. This goes to super admin. That means if you are a, a super admin, it goes to you that the ticket is raised by the company users so that they may get support from you if you are handling the service. Contracts, what are the contracts inside the company? So contract can be seen and new can, contracts can be added here like employee name and the subject. What are the contract with the employee? this is HRM solution not the CRM solution so the contract is between the company and the employee next is the recruitment solution this is again a very comprehensive solution HRM solution needs this so job application job and new job can be created here so the job title and the gender and the basic details of job job description job requirement and the job can be listed so job create option is here jobs can be seen here all created jobs so this is list job application what had been received uh, so applied or rejected or can be seen here a job candidate so candidate module can access this job listing so as an admin of company uh, the administrator of company going to list this so HR head can be said so job onboarding and the uh, uh, custom question just in case if you want to put in the system before uh, Applying interview schedules can be set here, like on the calendar. So this can be a schedule. So every day there are different timings. Uh, the career options can be handled here. So job openings and all. So this is career option. And this is all. So the next is I'm going to show you HR admin setup. So there can be different HR admin setup. So award. Uh, transfers and the registration uh, resignation okay sorry the trip and the promotions so the okay so what admin can set here so this is the screen warnings and the terminations and all next is the training type training module so this is training list and the trainer list Finance module is here, account list, account balance, the pay, the payers, the deposit, this is all for. 
Uh, this is performance indicators. So in a HRM system, this is also a very important part. So you can set the performance indicator like branch wise, it can be said department and the business process for behavioral competency, the organization competency, there can, can be different level of uh, performance indicators. So appraisal system is here and the goal tracking, what goal had been achieved by the employees. Next is the time sheet. That is again an important part for a HRS, HRM prospective. So time sheet can be created here, like select an employee, what is the time sheet and the uh, entry hours and the remarks. So again, it can be generated through AI. Many leave option, attendance options are here. Marking attendance option is here. So this is again going to be very simple. Select the monthly or the daily or and select the branch and the department and the attendance and be filtered and marked here. So this is the action. So this is clock in, clock out and the attendance marking system. Bulk attendance system is also here just in case uh, if it is required to mark the bulk attendance to respective branch and the department so it can be attendance and it can be simply updated so the filter can be applied here in the attending so there is no data since it is the demo installation biometric attendance system is also here so it is not limited to manual attendance biometric system attendance can be applied next is the payroll so salary can be set as the payroll and the pay slip is here. Uh, okay, payroll. I could be, uh, so I'm going to show you this screen. This is the payroll screen and this is a very important screen. So all details can be created here like allowance options, the loan options, the commissions, the employment salaries, like set salary options and all. And similarly, the pay slip is according to payroll. So generate pay slips and uh, edit the pay slip and click to Pay the pay slip, it is option. So the, the payment and pay slip paid successfully. So it is going to imply, of course. And this is the employee list again. So in a HRM system, this is the main part. So you are handling the employees. So this is the employee list. And further, the details can be checked here or for any particular employees. Or you can add new employee from this screen. So create new employee, employee name, all the details and the certificate, photo and all. So it can be simply staff list. So the system user is staff, the role and the employee profile. So this is a staff is for the HRM source time, employee is for organization. So I have shown you all the screens in the company login. I'm now moving to next login. So the last time we seen the company administrator login, login. Now this is HR login. So HR head or HR admin is logging this. So, and the screens are almost same and, and there is no difference. Just permission is changed and the login screen is different. So the staff can be seen here, the employee, the payroll, the time sheet, the performance and the HR admin setup, the recruitment solutions can be seen here and all are similar as you seen in the company level. So this is not much different. And finally, I am logged in as employee. So this is the employee screen and employee can check all the details related to him, particularly him or her, of course. So employee, employee details, own details can be seen, the payroll, the salary, the pay slip. This is the salary of employee, but it cannot be edited by employee, of course. And the pay slip is here. So the pay slip can be downloaded. However, it is not available any pay slip is not available here okay so it is just a data demo data the performance of particular staff the indicator all these screens are same but this is applicable to staff so there is no edit permission the staff can check all these details applicable for him the meeting details the due meetings if any and the company policy can be downloaded here because it is applicable for a staff so whatever has been set by the admin can be downloaded here and uh, similarly in the documents that is applicable for particular style. So this is a complete end-to-end -end solution and this is not but list. This is the messenger where we staff can uh, start communication with other employees like this is the A and message can be start here. Okay, so I was saying this is the complete solution end-to-end -end at every level like the super admin, you can set up the solution. The company login can handle the 
respective staff and company onboarding solutions there might be different branch multi level branches as well the hr part are again hr hr people are going to access the system at their level and the employee part so there can, there are four different stages of logging and this makes the system complete and surprisingly this system is available just for 29 dollars so you can easily assume how easy it is going to be how uh, it is enable price this is for onboarding on the system and the good part the sys solution is also available in wordpress versions or non size model so if you are willing to have and the solution for your company it is just available for 19 dollars yes 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 for a single company if you are going to use non size model i mean if you are not going to uh, sell it to multiple companies and willing to use at a at a single company this is just for 19 dollars so Again, it is a surprising price and you can have this solution completely. So follow the video description link, buy this script and let us join together um, and we are going to set it up at your domain, at your hosting. So data is completely going to be yours. There is no sharing and it is a white cable solution. So I believe this video remained helpful in understanding this complete HRM, Go, HR and the PR, HRM and the PRL solution and you will be definitely get benefited with this solution. So in the next video, I'm coming with more solution. Keep watching, keep building and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.